throw at the Mitch of homeland, I'm guessing that there's less than a hundred of us that can speak the language. And Norman may be the youngest. I'm 75 years old, so I'm one of the youngest. The biggest problem with what's been happening in the Michif world since revitalization has come along is that everything we do, we have to anglicize it. We should be Michifizing everything. And we have, well, what does that mean in English? It means nothing because it's not English, it's Michif. So that's how we have to have our way of thinking and saying, you have to speak Michif, think Michif, and do things in Michif. As soon as you change it into English, then it's got no more concept. You lose the whole concept of the story, mm -hmm. the history, the feelings. All those things are gone within a foreign language. So we're trying our best in this process to revitalize the language through this process where we somehow are teaching those that want to be well-grounded in their thoughts and their whole learning process because if they're the future, what is the future? What does the future hold, right? Again, I'll say that I'm personally very proud to participate in the Saskatoon project. I'll make sure, and the Mitchell community of Saskatoon will make sure that we do a good job here in promoting the language through our, our children.